So our flight got delayed about 45 minutes, I think. We're supposed to start boarding in 20 minutes unless there's another delay. So hopefully that goes good. I guess there's a really big snowstorm in Minnesota, which is where we're traveling to for Thanksgiving. By the way, good morning. I know we haven't technically said it. We're traveling there and it, there's a snowstorm or something. So we got delayed about 45 minutes in Texas. My mom also got delayed about two hours because there's just like lots of airplanes that aren't like letting people, oh my God, people go in and out. So hopefully we should be taking off in about 20, no, boarding in about 20 minutes. That's the goal. Daddy? Yes, thank you. Daddy, where's Daddy? You got your phone right, Ben? <laughs> See Daddy? Yeah. Oh, cool. oh yeah, that would be awesome. Oh, All right. Let's, Let's go. go. Huh? Oh, I got it. Thank oh, you so much. That's so sweet. So tired. So if she's cranky, don't take it personally. I know you're so tired. Oh, we're so sleepy. Oh, you're okay. Let's go so we can fall asleep in the car, okay? Good morning you guys, long time no talk because we landed last night or yesterday afternoon we came straight to this place that we're staying at with my family which I want to give you guys a tour of it later because it's huge, it's like seven bedrooms, eight bedrooms, it's insane, our whole family is staying in this huge house in Wisconsin and I really want to show you guys um, but it's been just crazy, we spent last night hanging out with family obviously and today is Thanksgiving so happy Thanksgiving, I just snuck upstairs for a couple minutes while everyone is hanging out with Emma downstairs so I could get ready but this is all we're getting this Thanksgiving a sweater and some turkey eating pants because I didn't want to bring a dress I'm so cold the bedrooms are nice because they've got these really nice fireplaces that you control with the heating system but downstairs it's just central heating and I'm a wimp so even though everyone else thinks it's totally fine I'm just a wimp and I'm not gonna be the one that says it's cold so I'm just wearing a sweater and jeans for Thanksgiving and that's okay because honestly Whatever makes me comfortable is all that matters. I do want to show our room though because it's so funny and interesting to me. This is like a super old house. So this is our bed obviously and Emma's pack and play. Every room has a fireplace that is like the heater for that room. So there's this little thing right here. You turn it up, the fireplace goes on. So that's really cool. They've all got this giant like jet bathtub in every room. I, like, you guys know me and my bathtub issue, I'm not going to get into it. I don't even know how I would bathe Emma in this because it's so deep that I'd have to go in there with her, so I might just have to, like, suck it up and do it, but there's these giant tubs, and then every room has a bathtub, or not a bathtub, but a, well, yeah, a bathtub, and a toilet and sink, so just, like, perfect for our family. There's, like, eight bedrooms, like I said, I think there's... 16 of us total so it's a crowded group but happy thanksgiving and uh i'm really excited to take emma in the snow i honestly just want to get ready so i can take her out in the snow and go see what she thinks of it i'm so excited <laughs> can i see her <laughs> oh my god she's so cute she's got like seven layers she's got like seven layers on oh my god i want to see what she thinks all right let's put her down and see this is her first time I gotta find a good spot. Justin, the protective dad again. Be careful. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, that snow is cold. What do you think? <laughs> it doesn't even look like her because it's like it's go she's so big in this, like chubby, because she's got like so many layers on. Let's stay down here, okay? Oh my God. 
That way we don't slip. What do you think of it, honey? You're going to town. <laughs> Did you what hear that? It's probably the cold. She gets it from mama. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> stepping off the tree. Justin's so worried. <laughs> I just feel like there's going to be a little patch of ice that she's going to eat it. She's okay. I think she's done. <laughs> she's like, get me out of here. Come on. Come on, snow monster. Good step. <clears throat> wow, that was good. Wow. can Oh, good job. She probably doesn't want to like put her hands on the floor because of the gloves. She's confused by the... Yeah, where are we going? Don't step off that. This is Emma's like first ever time seeing snow before. Freaking, I'm Unsh cold. I'm I just cold. have this shirt on. I should have put something else uh, on. Yeah, you it probably should have. It's really, it's like 22. 20 right now? It's 22 yeah. degrees here. So I know some of you guys are going to be like, that's They're not that like, bad. That's nothing. But for us, this is freezing. Oh, let's not eat the leaf. Say bye bye, Grandma. Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> She's just staring at <laughs> Still remember back in the day First ride in open sleigh I was a child I was the kind of smile The night before Black Friday and we have really not picked up the camera that much this week but we've been spending so much time with family she's gonna pour that entire bag of goldfish out I really want to show you guys a tour of the entire house before we leave so I'll probably do that maybe I can do that right now actually so if you guys haven't seen the house we're staying at this place it's called the Hollister mansion it's like how many bedrooms do you think I thought it was seven it's or eight five bedrooms I thought it was seven or eight no, bedrooms. Only five bedrooms, but there's the, the loft, the loft area. So upstairs. technically there's more. There's um, but I'm gonna give you guys a little tour. It's absolutely beautiful. I would show you the outside, but um, it's freezing out there. We're gonna go out there in a minute and take her out in the snow. But first, we'll start with the kitchen. There's this little butler's kitchen, which is just really small. Um, and then a staircase that goes up, but that'll be the last thing we do. Here's the beauty of Miss Kitchen. And you walk through, there is a basement, but I guess there's nothing in it. No, it's just empty. It's empty, okay. It's not finished. This is the front door. There's like a little heated patio area where we keep our coats. And then the sitting room, by the way, this house is a mess right now. Dining room. There are two more sitting rooms over there. Then I'm gonna show you the upstairs. This is the best part. This is the front view to outside. Okay, so here is the second floor where most of the bedrooms are. There's this room, which is really cool. It's like a circle. I think it's called like a turret room. Really cool room. There is a big bedroom over here. Like I said, all of them have these tubs and then these giant bathtubs. So that's two bedrooms, three bedrooms, four. This is the staircase that led from the kitchen, five, and then six, and then this door, my cousins are up there, I'm not gonna go up there right now, goes to another <laughs> room upstairs where there's like a loft, and in the loft they put um, a couple of beds for them to sleep up there, so it's absolutely beautiful. We rented it on Airbnb, the whole family is staying here, so there's like 16 of us, it's, it's like sleep 16 people. It's absolutely adorable and beautiful, and I'm actually gonna go back through the back way, because that makes more sense. And we're gonna go outside in the snow. These stairs are so steep. It's actually really scary. There we go. Back in 
the kitchen. We're taking another snow break. We can only do these breaks for like two or three minutes before it gets too cold for her. But she's done touching the snow. She's done touching it. Hey, are you gonna go? Come on! Yeah, good job. This house is on this beautiful, by the way, this is the house they're staying in. It's called like the Hollister Mansion. <laughs> and it's across the street from, this is a church, but I guess it's also a school. It's just so pretty, look how much. Like there's like a little road right here. Some houses. It's just beautiful. Even the patio is beautiful. <laughs> She's doing really good. She's not upset. I thought she wasn't going to want to come out, honestly. She hasn't been outside in like two days. Well, she had a hard time days. walking the other day. This is a good area because it's, it's not It's a lot thick. less thick, yeah. But she has, she's been getting cabin fever, I think. Whoa. So I think we're going to go in in a minute. Ooh. Come on, Emma! <laughs> Want to hold mommy's hand? Come on, Emma! Good job! Go, go, go! Good job! Oh. Oh, so that's cold, Auntie. Oh, she keeps pulling her gloves right off, so oh, that's okay. Do you want me to hold you? Uh, Auntie. No. Oh, Auntie. Fun. Emma, let me see. Oh. Mo? Mo? <laughs> we need a doggy to make her happy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Are you what are you trying to do? It's so ugly. <laughs> You can read how ugly it sounds. Is that what you're trying yeah. to say? Emma. You didn't even write the A. You just Dude, put it's M. because I'm using a thin stick. It's like using a <laughs> pencil. I think it's sweet. You're, I think it's sweet <laughs> that you're trying to write her name in the first place. But oh, I got that. snow in my boot. Oh, good. He <laughs> so said in your boobs. Oh, There's a snow in my boot. I'm gonna do a weird E. Oh, rude. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm done. It is I'm so done. bad. Your dad's bad not idea. daddy. That's this is crazy. A bad idea. Oh, there's so much snow in my shoes. In your boobs. <laughs> I thought in that's my boobs. <laughs> us at all, huh? <laughs> I was just telling Justin I look like death the second I opened up this camera. Maybe I look worse than you. <laughs> no, you don't. Um, we are home. We are finally, finally home. So last night we got home at what, 11.30? 11.30. 11.30. 
11 or 11.30 at night. It was really late. Our flight was delayed leaving an Minnesota. Hour an hour and 20 minutes. But it felt Correct. like three, three or four hours. The flight itself felt like six hours, maybe. Yeah. Well, Emma, you know like when you bring a kid on an airplane and they already don't want to be on there. So you're like, let's just take off and go. Because then at least they're unhappy, but you're going somewhere rather than they're unhappy and you're not moving. It's like sitting in a car that's not driving. It was pretty, pretty bad. You can't see her because she's in the bathtub. Um, it was pretty brutal. So we were already super delayed and then the whole flight she slept 20 minutes when it should have been like she should have slept the entire flight because it was her bedtime. So she cried most of the time. Yeah, I, I feel like say. this was definitely our worst flight with her. Uh, probably, I think she was, she, we flew at seven o'clock at night, which is where we, when we had been putting her down for bed. And she slept 20 minutes total on the three and a half, was it three and a half hours? Three four and hours. And a half, yeah. I thought it was four hours actually, I don't know. It was a long, it felt long, it felt like 10 hours. So we, we made it though, we made it. And luckily we had her car seat on the airplane so she could just like, sleep in that when she did I sleep. Know. I wish she would have slept more, but that is it. We are home. It was such a good trip, but I will say Emma is a homebody because the second we came home, well, not really last night because we put her straight to bed, morning. but this morning she's been in her complete normal mood again when we were traveling. She was having a rough time with the jet lag and with, you know, lots of other people that she's never met before. It's my family. There's 16 of us. It's overwhelming. So I think if we had done it here, she would have been fine, but because we were traveling and there were so many people that she was just overwhelmed. So I'm actually really happy to be home as well, as much fun as we had. It was so much fun. I love my family. Justin loves my family. We only get to see them like every other Thanksgiving. Yeah. It's like our family's thing that we do. Um, my mom, like I said, is one of seven. So I have a big family and not everyone even went. We were missing like- Two people? Right? No, not two, four, five, oh, six, no, seven, yeah, yeah. Sorry, eight, about eight to 10 people <laughs> still. So it was, it was a smaller eight. group than it normally is, but it was really, really fun. And we are so glad to be home. And I'm gonna get this vlog up today if I can for you guys. I'm so sorry because I know there's like a lack of footage um, but honestly, like, we were there for how many days? Four days total, yeah. Wednesday through Saturday, and we spent most of the time talking, playing games, and catching up on stuff that we haven't caught up on in two years because so much happens in two years with family, like, changing and stuff, and my family's all over the world, like, all over, not the world, but the United States. So <coughs> we really don't see each other. You okay? <laughs> We don't see each other. Oh, that was so disgusting. <laughs> we don't see each other that much. Um, and we just wanted to hang out. So apologize for that, but it was a really good trip. Emma loved the snow, except for she kept pulling her gloves off. Besides that, it was really fun. We only went out for a couple minutes at a time because she was, I don't know, her little nose would get red like instantly. But other than that, I'm rambling at this point. We're home. I would say, you know, here's Emma. But like I said, she's in the bathtub because she was so gross getting off the airplane. So with that being said, we're gonna end the vlog. Well, come here. Come here, buddy. Can I say bye bye? You haven't been in the vlog in a while either. And we'll talk to you again very, very soon. I think we're getting our dining room table today. So we'll check out soon. Bye. bye.